and we'll wish you the last of the best in your new chapters of your life. So if you can come forward for your black.
We would like to recognize the following for their life-saving efforts on that day. Congratulations to the officers and disadvantages. Come on up.
recently had an opportunity to speak to members of the public and the press. And we had, I told them that in Sturbridge, the police department, the fire department, and the dispatchers, even though we all wear <coughs> different uniforms, we're really all in the same uniform. Uh, and I think these next two awards will really highlight that. On Sunday, June 4th, 2023, dispatcher Patricia Lucacino received a 911 call from a mother reporting that her two-year-old son was found in their pool, unconscious, not breathing, with no pulse. It was uncertain how long the child had been in the water. Dispatcher Lucacino immediately gave CPR instructions over the phone. And, dispatcher, and dispatch officer Garrett Dana Officer Nicole Patterson and the Sturbridge Fire Department to the scene. <clears throat> Officer Dana and Officer Patterson arrived on scene, quickly administered life saving CPR. Yeah. <laughs> Lieutenant, <Matthew, coughs> Lieutenant Matthew Roderick, along with firefighter paramedics Stephen Joyce, James Towns, and Christopher Wynott, and firefighter EMT Michael Gelinas, arrived administered advanced life support and transported the patient to the hospital. Due to the life-saving efforts of all that were involved, this young boy has made a full recovery and is spending valuable time with his family. And it not been for the quick actions, knowledge, and professionalism of all involved, there probably would have been a much different outcome. Tonight, we'd like to recognize <coughs> the following individuals for their efforts. <coughs> if you'd all come up as I call your name. Dispatcher Lucacino, Officer Dana, Officer Patterson, Lieutenant Roderick, Firefighter Joyce, Firefighter Towns, Firefighter Wynum, Firefighter Joyce. <laughs> Officers Garrett Dana, Nicole Patterson, and Daniel Hemingway 
were dispatched to the scene. Officers Dana and Patterson arrived on the scene and assisted Officer Schlegel and Braden with their life-saving CPR efforts. An AED was placed on Officer LaValle and at one point he was shot by the life-saving device. Officer Daniel Hemingway arrived on scene and assisted with the life-saving efforts as well as comforting the family and later getting them transported to the hospital. Lieutenant and Paramedic Sean Moyna and Firefighter EMP Joseph Dorian arrived on the scene to find the patient <coughs> unresponsive with CPR in progress and the AED applied. Lieutenant Moyna and Firefighter Dorian administered advanced life support while Officer Patterson drove the ambulance to the hospital. Due to the life-saving efforts of all that were involved, Officer LaValle <coughs> is on the path to making a full recovery and is with us this evening. We'd like to recognize the following civilians, dispatchers, officers, and firefighters for the life-saving efforts that night. Miss, Mrs. Sandy LaValle and Mr. Brady Filios, dispatchers Benjamin Grasso and Aaron Berry, officers Matthew Schlegel, Eric Dana, Nicole Patterson, and Daniel Hemingway, and fire personnel, Lieutenant Sean Moyna, and Joseph, the firefighter Joseph Lagori. So please come on and be ready.